All right, so this is it. Finally, we've already captured some emails, and now it's time to make money. Okay, so it's time to write your emails, build value, build relationship, and then promote your products and services and make money using the power of emails. Okay, so welcome back to email marketing training using Get Responses as the pillow. Okay, so. In the previous videos, we've already we've already captured some emails, but we've already promoted the landing page natin and captured some emails. So, ngayon, let let me show you how you can write your email using GetResponse. So, basically, punta ka lang dito sa email marketing, okay? And then, by the way, there are two types of emails that you can send. Number one is the broadcast email, meaning uh, you're gonna send an email to everybody on your list. Another another email naman is yung autoresponder. Okay? So, ito, autoresponder meaning it is pre-scheduled. Okay? Pre-scheduled meaning you're gonna write the, the emails ahead of time and then once may subscribe, automatic they will receive all those emails pre-scheduled. Okay? So, ito yung automation. Okay? So, actually, mayroon ditong automation. Medyo complicated na to, pero... What I want you to focus is kahit ito newsletters lang and then autoresponder, uh, you can already make tons of money using emails. All right, so let's write our email. So you just simply punta ka dito again. Balik tayo sa dashboard. Ha? <laughs> so punta ka lang dito sa email marketing. Click mo, click mo yan, and then mapupunta ka sa newsletters. Okay, so yung gagawin natin right now is broadcast. So we're gonna write an email, send it, and then we're gonna check if we receive ba na mga subscribers natin. Okay, so once you go to news newsletter, cl click malatong create newsletter, create newsletter. Right, and then you will choose from this one. Ito na lang, drag and drop email editor. Actually, I don't know how to use this one. Okay, so ito drag and drop email editor. And then, ito na, um, link list, ano ba yung list na, what list will you be broadcasting, okay? So, we're gonna use ito, sample demo list, okay? And then, ito na yung subject line and message name. So, ito, you can just use, this one is for personal consumption, personal consumption. And this one, ito yung subject line na receive ng mga prospects mo, or yung mga subscribers mo. So, hello, this is my friend first email. So, parang gano'n. And then, yan din yung subject line na gagamitin ko. And then, kagandahan din ni GetResponse, you can personalize. Personalize. Like, say for example, this one, pwede kang mag maglagay ng first name. Okay? First name, comma, hello, this is my first email. So, parang gano'n. Okay? And then, just click the next step. So, ito yung subject line. Alright? Tapos, you'll be given templates, so you can choose from the templates that's given. But usually, I don't use their templates kasi masyadong madaming pictures, masyadong maraming colors. And usually, kapag emails, if it's full of pictures, usually, especially kapag yung recipient mo or yung subscriber mo is a Gmail subscriber, possible kasi mapunta yung email mo sa promotions tab. And once it goes there, promotions tab, minsan hindi nila nakikita yung mga emails mo. Okay? Kaya yung highly suggestion ko is plain text-based emails. Okay? Again, plain text-based. So, puro text lang talaga yung nasa emails. Okay? So, I don't use templates. I don't use these templates. But what I do is, dito ako sa start from scratch. Okay? And then, usually blank template yung din ginagamit ko. Okay? Blank template. So, in writing emails, there's a formula that you can use. It's called the three E. So, entertain, educate, and then earn. Okay? Entertain, educate, and earn. So, paano ba yan? So, ito pala, drag and drop. So, you can drag the text block. And then, if you're gonna add some image, you can drag image there. Okay? And then, if gusto ka may button dyan, pwede rin ganyan. But again, I don't usually use all these other tools. Ito lang talaga yung text block yung ginagamit ko. And then, I adjust it para medyo may space. It looks good on the eyes. Okay. And then, ayun. Let's type. Let's type. So, hi. You can customize, di ba? Hi, first name. Parang ganon. 
And then I usually use Arial. <laughs> and yung yan yung default ko. Then oops. Okay. Ano nga ulit yun? Educate. Oh. Entertain. Educate. And then educate. And then earn. Alright? And then let's unbold it. So entertain dito. You will share something that's entertaining. Let's say for example stories. Okay. Like something make people curious. Okay. So you can share stories dito. Make people curious. You can share some jokes, okay? Parang ganun. You can share the latest chika, okay? Okay, so parang ganun. And then from there, this one is, at least you can build value and you can connect with people. Sa entertain pala. This one is connecting with people. Sa educate naman, dito na is building value. So dito na you're gonna teach. You're gonna teach. You're gonna share share some lessons okay share some lessons and then build value and then finally sa earn naman where is it oops i can't see it there yun sa earn naman is eto na yung tinatawag natin na Call to action. Call to action. Anong sabihin nito? Anong ibig sabihin nito? Like, if you want to learn more, click, go over here, go over here, and check out my awesome product. <laughs> Parang ganun. Okay. Check out my awesome product. And then, dito na yung link. Yourproductlink.com Pwede mong isulat yung link. Pwede din. Copy mo to. And then, ito. Insert link. Okay? Insert link. There. Alright. So, tapos, create your desired lifestyle. Alright? So, as simple as that. Alright. And then, we're gonna broadcast it. But, again, before you broadcast this one, mm, make sure you check the spam score. Okay? Check the spam score. Kaganda niya siya get response. You can check the spam score. Dito sa test message. Spam score. Okay, so as you can see, one yung score ko. And then sabi niya dito, don't go above five. Kasi if you go above five, it's possible na mapupunta yung email mo sa spam folder nila. So we don't want that. So that's why you need to check your spam score. So usually yung mga spam, spam terms like financial freedom. We need to avoid words like financial freedom. I guarantee... No, money back guarantee. These are very highly abused words that uh, highly abused words that usually would would tawag nito would trigger yung email service provider mo na spam siya. So let's check, di ba? See, naging 5. <laughs> naging 5 kasi you say something like freedom, financial freedom or money back guarantee. So, you don't say that in your emails, okay? You minimize using those words in your emails, okay? And then, make sure you also send a test email. Send a test email, okay? Ano ibig sabihin nito? So, you can check. You can check. So, ito yung test email. I'm sending a test email now. So, wait natin. Ayun, ito na. Hello, this is my first email. So, this one is a test email. Okay, so makikita mo dito, di ba? So this one is the test email. I'm gonna show you. Uh, let's now broadcast it, okay? Meaning we're gonna send it now. 
Kanina kasi, test email yon So, napunta dun sa email ko. Okay? So, next step. After that one, after you write your email, you just go to next step. Dito sa baba. Next step. And then, you can choose the list where you will send it. So, let's just choose ito, sample demo list. Okay? So, sa sample demo list, once you choose that, you just click next step. And then, there's some review. You can review ano yung mga sinulat mo. Okay? And then, you just hit the send button. Hit the send button. So, this one is broadcasting, meaning, ginawa mo, and then you hit send, and then everybody's gonna receive the email. Okay? So, usually, it takes like 60 seconds. So, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait for it. Okay? And tapos, if we're gonna receive, Okay? Tapos, yun nga, yun yung broadcast. In the next following video sa man, I'm gonna show you how you can do your your autoresponder. Autoresponder. Okay? Using get response. So, if ever may mga questions kayo, uh, there's a comment box down below. So, hit comment. And then, if you have may mga questions kayo, mga concerns kayo, oh, you, just, you just put in your comments down below. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So, I could also answer your mga questions nyo. Tapos, ayun nga, uh, I've been using email marketing in promoting different things like affiliate products, my own digital products, okay, even my own services. And so far, I guarantee you it's still very effective. It's still one of the best ways on how you can promote your products and services. Okay? So now, it has been sent according to your settings. Okay? So check natin nga if we're gonna receive it. So this one is the test email. So most likely... This this email is gonna receive more of this of this uh, email. Okay, let's just wait for it. Check natin na. Means I I also check the spam folder because means <laughs> na pupunta sa spam. Eh. That's why you really need to check. Okay. So anyhow, so while waiting for this one for the email, um, meron tayong stats or statistics. So you can also see eh, kamusta yung performance ng email mo. Okay, when you send a broadcast email, check mo din yung, yung performance. If somebody opened your email, if somebody has clicked the link, okay? So, punta tayo sa email marketing. And then, sa newsletters. Okay. Check natin. Hindi pa na-receive. Ayun, napunta pa nga sa promotions eh. <laughs> napunta sa promotions. Okay. So, this one went to promotions. Okay. Ayun, yun yung pangalawa. Yung second naman is napunta sa email. It went directly to the inbox. Okay. So, refresh natin. So, this one, ito yung napunta sa inbox. Okay. Ito yung ginawa natin, di ba? And then the link. So, i-click natin yung link. Okay. So, by the way, this link does not exist. Okay. <laughs> ginawa ko lang yung link na yan. And then, at the same time, eto yung promotion. Kasi, let's just assume na hindi nakita. Yeah, if you can notice, chof dito. Yung sa isa naman is tiyo, pilo. Okay? So, because we, we written two different emails and two different names. Pero napunta dito sa same Gmail ko. <laughs> okay? So, now let's look at the statistics. So, eto yung email na sinen natin or naging na-delivered yung dalawa. And then, you just basically go to statistics. Okay? So, punta ka dito sa gilid and then statistics. Click mo yung statistics na yan. So, yung isa nag-open and then nag-click ng link. So, makikita natin yan sa statistics. Okay? So, makikita dito, it's sent. Uh, hello, this is my first email. So, sent dalawa and then opened isa and then may isa na nag-click. Okay? So, makikita mo talaga yung, yung statistics mo. So, 50%. So, opened and can unopened and then the one who click. And then, makikita mo din, show contact sino yung mga nag-click. Sino yung mga nag-opened. Okay? So, very powerful if you know the statistics, you know yung performance ng emails mo. Okay? So, I hope you learned something. In the next following videos, I'm gonna show you yung, yung autoresponder, how you can automate your email marketing strategy sa online business mo. So, I hope you learned something. Once again, this is Tio Pelo. And by the way, if wala ka pang account to get response, there's a link down below. Click mo yan and then create your free account in GetResponse. Alright, once again, Tio Pilo here and see you in the next video. Bye-bye!